Hello, everybody. Manta Ray back for Space Engineers Reconomy Light, episode 36, I think. Episode 36, that sounds right. Um, so, uh, where are we? We are picking up from last episode. Um, we have quite a few red signals out here, which I'm not super thrilled about. Our antenna is off, which is good. Um, we've got our defense installation, scouting outpost, scouting outpost, supply transport, and a docking station over there, and then it's the same scouting outpost over there. Okay, so we've we got to get ourselves situated kind of where we're going. We've got uh, this guy charging. Um, I think at the end of last episode, I checked what his current charge was. Let's go and check that real quick. Battery, and it is fully charged. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, nice. Perfect. Okay. So this guy's good to go. So let's finish these. Let's finish these. Awesome. Okay. Um, let's see. What do we got? Hup, hup. Let's see how many we're missing. Finish these turbines here. One, two, three, and one. So four turbines. So if I check my build planner, I don't have any turbines. Stackable. Where yet? Stackable wind turbines. One, two, three. Grab these. And full up, baby. And we should, with all this power now, be able to turn on the doors. <laughs> let's fill her up. Virgil? Okay, we're all full. Alright, let's take this guy. Go. Beautiful. This is the one that I should be almost out of. Yeah. All right. Let's go grab the last parts for this, and we should be good to go. And then we need to get the rest of these um, columns. And done. Beautiful. Love it. All right, there we go. Columns are done, turbines are done. All good. So let's... Let's charge this thing, because it's at 87%. Uh, no, let's set it down. Okay. Pressure's off, everything's off. There we go. That should be all connected now. Yep, garden is set. Let's call this garden interface since I have never done that before. Vegetable grower, wheat farm, wheat farm. And that's it, that's everything. Okay, what's next? Um, so we got power, we got batteries, we should have at least. Here is battery, it is 18.1% charged, it is charging. That one is 26.7% charged. I feel like I should add another battery here. All right, battery's done. Love it. And this battery should also be charging. Yep, it's charging too, sweet. So I have enough to be charging all these things. That's fantastic. How's my iron situation? Oh, plenty of iron. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good on iron. So, are the welders functional? They sure are. All right, so everything on the welders is fixed. So here's the question. Do we build another piston tower? Just grab this guy. I think we do, for now. I think that's what we should do. Piston? And I say, let's make them big. Let's make them big. How many pistons is that? I guess we'll find out when we get down. I don't think I turned off the welders. That is key. Welded and welded. And that's everything. Okay, great. So that should be the end of it. Not that they're super important, because I'm not actually transporting anything, but it's important. Okay, now I only have steel, which should be fine, because let's use um, armored conveyors. Reinforced conveyor to... Actually, again, they're not conveying anything. It doesn't really matter. Just use heavy armor. There you go. 
and then we'll drop a piston here. Yoink. Probably like three pistons, I would think. At least two. Piston part, and piston. Okay, so let's grab <clears throat> the piston, printer piston. That's the base. Can I name him base? Yep, and then one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's share initial tensor for all those, but let's add all those and save them. Hey, look at that, super close, fantastic. But it's not over far enough, look. Oh man, that sucks. Okay, well we can fix this, we can fix this. <clears throat> and you know how we fix this? I know exactly how we fix this. Okay, there's block there. We need to turn this hinge somehow. Um, can I just like slap like a big battery on this thing or something and then grind it away? I hate to waste this stuff, but I think that might be what we need to do. There we go. That's better. Okay. Now we have power. Can I reverse this to go to the other side? It's not quite perfect, but it's close. But if we can do that, and then we grab a merge block, slap it on the other side. <clears throat> oh. Uh, lower limit is... Nope. Upper limit is 90. There we go. That might just work. Kind of. Okay, merge block built. Oh, dear. Oh. Toad's turning this thing on. Okay, um, now for this, I think this is going to work out just fine. Ermagerd, it's so close. Okay, it's literally there. I just need to give it a nudge. Surely this will work just fine. Okay, that's pretty perfect. Alright, there's no way this can go poorly. Uh, totally not poorly. Nope, everything's fine. It's just a tank, just the other tank. That's all, that's it, that's it. There's nothing else. Alright, well there's all... Alright, at least somewhat, that's, that's sorted. And then we'll work on this later and make it further out and, and fix it better. Okay, great, but key point, fighter is up, fighter's back, back in action. We should put those tanks back. Tank. Tank. All right. This is not the worst thing I've ever seen. How's the other side look? It just looks fine because we didn't even get started on it. Okay, we're, we're, we're back. Now, the question is, do we do anything else to fortify or do we just keep working on the fighter so we can actually fight somebody off when they come to attack us? I don't know. Look at the front of the base. I didn't even notice that base got shot up something fierce that corner is busted oh all this this whole corner yeah, the whole roof is all shattered up in here oh not good factory lights on boom there we go now we can see again we got izzy running we got doors open again we got the farms back together we got the fighter back up on a on a build platform sort of it's kind of in the way but you know it's not the worst thing ever you know, what you could do is you could disconnect this whole thing and just put a big foot on it. Go up there, extend this out a bit further, and then put a big foot on it and just lift it. <sighs> we'll see. We will see. We will see. Right now, not to jinx anything, but right now there isn't anybody trying to kill us, so that is a plus. What is up there smoking? Alright, there you go. Fixed. Now we need to get up on the roof because there was some damage. Alright, what was over here? You said there was a, a conveyor that was damaged? Is that what I saw? Look at that. Fix that. Okay, so for the, the basic stuff, I think everything's fixed, mostly. And we should put some protection around this for sure, around the, around the refinery, just to cover it. So maybe that'll be next week. Uh, but yeah, we've got we've got some serious fixing to do. Look at the roof. All shot up with the bulletproof glass survived somehow. Well, actually, oh, look at that. It actually took some hits. That's not bad. 35 out of 36. Yeah, I lost one piece of glass. 
do do do. Man, that was bad. This was this was a bad attack. I'm glad that we have some protection this go around. We got our gun here. He's watching. He's checking things out. He has nothing in his inventory. Atlas ammo magazines. No Atlas ammo magazines. Can I make Atlas ammo? Yeah, we can. What do you need? Oh, we got it. Nice. Okay, okay. So he should start getting some ammo. Yeah, look at that. He's got some loaded. Sweet. All right, so what did we have going on here? We've got connection to all these. Connection to the cockpit. Connection to everything here. It was we were building up the nose. All right, got the plans back. All right, so I have it coming straight out from the cockpit, a smidgen. So it was like block, block, block. And then it goes kind of straightish down from there and then over. Yep, okay, beautiful. That's it. That's the jam. So that solves that problem. Oh, actually, we're missing our wings. Yeah, these are all done. These come all the way out. That comes all the way out. And then we're missing, we're missing our wings. So, yeah, okay, we actually need to lift this back up. Let's raise her up, Virgil. Okay, and then let's take a look. Where do we need to put these wings? Right there. They start right here. And what is it? It's a uh, six by five by one rounded edge. Block, block, block. And then we added one more of them. Yoink. There you go. That looks right. Guns are mounted to the sides of the cockpit towards the front. So about here, if I remember correctly. Hup. So to the sides of the cockpit, but kind of down from the cockpit, but from either side. The way this is built, <clears throat> they're almost going to have to sit next to the cockpit, kind of like right here. Oink, yoink. <clears throat> and then, oh, right, the battery that I added. Oh, oh. Sorry, battery. You gotta go, my friend. But there you go. And then we'll put our consolidated... Ah, uh, actually... Hold, please. Now, the plans had them kind of nestled. So maybe what I need to do is... do this number, and then put one there. I'm wondering if this makes the most sense or if it makes more sense to mount them up and then just put some stuff around them. No, no, I'm, just, I'm, I'm gonna do it this way. And then what we'll do is we'll build up around it. We'll put up like a, um, there we go. We'll put like, um, and then we'll do something on the back. I'm not quite sure what, but we'll do, we'll do something. Okay, the turbine's in the sun. That was a really bad idea. <laughs> They're kind of just shining in my eyes. That's very unpleasant. The whole base is covered in turbine shadow. So that can just kind of stay where it's at, I guess. And then we'll bring that down. And then over here, we'll start building these up, maybe. Yeah, we'll start doing this. Do maybe this number. Like that, start building it out that way. Looks good. Yeah, and then uh, and then we build out the wings on the upper top. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because it's it's not. Yeah, it's no higher than the cockpit, so the cockpit is the height. Yeah, just like that. And then we'll put a um, a wing on the top. Yeah, do something like that. What do you think? Yeah, that, that looks right. Yeah, yeah, that looks right. That looks right. Okay, cool. And we'll swing around this way. And we'll start building this out here so that we can then fit some wingage of the plumage right here. And I kind of had them kind of set in a little bit. So we'll do something like that. Maybe we'll put like, uh, just like kind of like right here. What do you think? Kind of like here? I think this looks about right. What do you think? Does that look big enough or is that is that not big enough? Uh, no, I had them actually going wider. So, let's see, let's do this. That's pretty good, I like that, okay, yeah. There you go. Oh, there we go. 
This is more what I'm looking for here. There we go. Yeah, that looks good. I like it. I like it. And then we'll put the uh, control surfaces on the back here. Good gravy, that's huge. Wowzers. Okay. Well, how are we doing on gyros? What do we have in the, in the realm of gyros? There were gyros, like, right here, weren't there? Didn't I put gyros, like, right here? I did, I'm pretty sure. Uh, let's see. Do I have any... Ah, uh, I do. Forward, right up. So let's put yoink. Oh, unable to place. Placed. Placed. There you go. There you go. We got two gyros. Kind of under the center of mass of this thing. All right, so far, so good. Mustache, mustache. Oh, there we go. Look at, look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Oh, it's beautiful. Question is, is it aerodynamic? I think so. Why not? Sure it is. I still play it again. Go figure. 200 steel plate this time. They can't stop me now. And voila. Okay. Well, there we go. That It's looking good. All right. I think that's looking really nice. All right, everybody. Well, thanks for joining me uh, for Reconomy Light episode 36, I believe. Um, as you saw, we've fixed up a lot of our stuff we um finished uh welding up those um uh, turbines those wind turbines so we've got plenty of uh you know, wind power now we got batteries charging you know under the base which we didn't have before for some reason um the little build platform that we made out of our respawn pod is working great so far obviously we'll you know work on that later and do what we got to do but we are working to get this fighter up and running because if something happens again we need to be able to get away safely um and potentially be able to fight off the bad guys so wouldn't that just be fantastic um i don't know about large grid stuff obviously yet but um you know a lot of them are pretty it seems like a lot of them are pretty low level armed so we might be able to you know get some good shots on things and shoot things down and you know maybe things will work out the way we want them to who knows but anyway everybody thanks for joining me as always really appreciate it thanks for always sticking with economy light i know it was a long time between, you know, uh, a long time ago, but we had a big, big gap um, when I moved. And we've recently had intermittent gaps as time has just not kind of worked out for me. Um, but uh, this is uh, the 9th of May. So uh, as of now, we are less than a week from closing on our new home. So we will be moving in that week um i should have the internet up and running pretty quick you know as time goes on uh you know that week actually potentially and then i can get my desk which i'm going to need uh to get because i don't have one currently anymore um and get stuff going and it is getting dark that's not good <laughs> um but i will be migrating back to the house within the month i would assume so come june come july for sure i will be back at the house doing great you know and, and being able to keep up with everything very reliably which i'm really looking forward to anyway everybody thank you again so much for watching economy light uh, thanks for your comments thanks for your likes thanks for your subscribing i, I love it uh, if you're not a member of the discord hop over there uh the link for that is in the description of all my videos um check out the website if you're interested in some text-based goodness uh, that is manticasm.online m-a-n-t-a-c-h-a-s-m dot online and that's all i have everybody i will catch you next time